Welcome to Ferrotone Studios. This is how far the guitar's got. As you can see, it's been sanded to 320 grit all over. Um, and I'm going to stain it, well the top's gonna to be stained, hopefully, with Crimson Guitars Stunning Stains. The plan is to just stain the top black and have it taped off and uh, just, I'll put a link to the Crimson Guitars video I'm using as a tutorial for this in this corner. Uh, and hopefully just have oiled back and sides. Oh, I've got a dent there, so I've got to sand that out. So I must have knocked it on something already. It's been about 10 seconds. Um, that's the plan. I'm hoping to have it oiled back and sides, black front, obviously oiled too. Uh, if it goes wrong, it's all gonna be black. Let's, let's go for it. Right, the plan is tape the sides with some good quality tape. This is Scotch Blue. I'll put a link to this in the description because I can never spend too much money on good tape. And then go over it with the Stunning Stains Black Stain. Good quality kitchen roll. This is a roll of plenty. I don't know if they sell it anywhere but the UK, but hopefully this should be good. Again, uh, I'll put a link to Crimson Guitars tutorials on how to use their stains and oils in the description because that's my guide for this. Wish me luck. So this has had one coat of black stain. Looks quite good. I quite like the fact the red's showing through because that's kind of what I wanted. Um, I'm gonna give it probably an hour, give it a light rub down, and then give it another going over. And I might call it a day at that. And then it's time to apply some oil, which will be, uh, again, Crimson Guitar stuff. Penetrating oil, sounds fun. Everyone likes penetrating. And then some high build. Yeah, so when that's dry, uh, so I'll stain it again tonight, give it a rub down tomorrow, and then we'll start applying some oil, the penetrating stuff first all over, and then leave that to hang up, and uh, basically follow the Crimson Guitars guides and tutorials on how to use it. I, mean, I only went to their website to get some black stains, so I couldn't find it anywhere else. And while I was there, I saw this stuff and watched a few videos, I thought, worth a try. I've, I've never used it before, but, looks good and their videos are fantastic so yeah links in the description i'm not getting i did i paid full prices didn't get any kind of discount there's no affiliate marketing never even met them but i'll find out if their products are good i have no doubt they are they look great on everything they make and this looks the nuts giving the guitar some time to dry it feels dry and as per the Crimson Guitars uh, tutorial, here's some 800 grit sandpaper, wet and dry. I don't know, all care, so I'm gonna go over it with that and then give it another black stain. And then we'll see how it looks. And then I'll leave that to dry for maybe 24 hours and then it's oiling time.
as you can see it's well it's stained black but it's kind of got a sort of reddy purple hue from the color of the sapili it's quite i know it's well brown but it's quite a reddy brown and the black seems to bring that out i think that looks absolutely fantastic i can't wait till it's oiled i'm going to leave that in here overnight uh it's heated in here so should dry um yeah and then oil it so like subscribe please leave a comment let me know what you think and let me know what you've made or what you're thinking of making and definitely check out crimson guitars and buy some of their oil this stuff is fantastic uh that looks the nuts i'm really impressed with that hopefully my uh <laughs> my blue tape held up and didn't seep too much if not i can just sand it back but yeah that that is brilliant i couldn't have hoped for it to end up better to be completely honest wow thanks for watching like and subscribe